an artist is not shy to express himself or herself for, with whatever medium. And it's usually but a bit shocking uh, at the, uh, the, uh, the beginning, right? So it could be in you know any type of uh, medium or craft. I mean, there are uh, artists of uh, instruments, handcrafters, uh, painters, uh, writers. So, I mean, if you're good enough and you can you know wow other people and you know generate something different, uh, yeah, I think that uh, you are an artist. Myself as an artist? No, no, I'm way too much in a box at this time. Sometimes I, I, I feel that I might, but uh, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. <laughs> well, my name is uh, Luis Schmid. I'm, um, I was born in Argentina. These guitars, the guitars that I make, uh, this uh, cigar box guitars have been around for, you know, 150 years. So that's, I guess, the people that, that did this in the past was a mix of what they wanted to do and necessity as well. They wanted to have an instrument. The instruments were not really available. I did get into this uh, by music. That's, uh, I mean, my passion has always been uh, music. I like to use things that had a life before. I like to recycle things, right? Um, for example, if I, if I find something that was uh, a fork on a prior life and I can be a tailpiece on this one, that's something that I, that I like. I go driving with my car, and sometimes I cannot because I'm not dressed in a particular way, but I see a dumpster and say, oh, there might be some good stuff in there. I probably need to jump in there, but, but I wouldn't do it with my, you know, uh, with other clothes. It, usually I get with one idea and I probably the end uh, product is something different. It's one of a kind. I mean, it's gonna be that instrument and there's not gonna be more instruments like that. Even if you want to, to replicate it, there's gonna be tiny differences from one to another. And that's, uh, I see them as, as, as people as well, as you know, as personalities. Each guitar, each instrument has its, uh, you know, personality and it's uh, basically reflected in the voice, in the sounds that they made. So it, each one of the handmade instruments that I found, each one of them sound different. When you got people telling you that, I mean, they have never seen anything like that before and it's actually, you know, playable instrument and, you know, their friends also like it. So that's basically the fuel that you need uh, as well to, you know, to go back to the shop and keep on doing this. And it's not going to be anything like uh, I did before because it's basically I cannot make it. If I want to, I cannot make the same guitar twice, right? So it's going to be, you know, very interesting for me and it's going to be interesting for, for somebody else. Uh, those are the things that you really, you know, you really appreciate. I, I love what I do at this time. I, I like to, you know, to build these instruments. And you know, while you do that, you, you know, you keep on learning. So at this point, I would say I would have to build quite a lot more. Yeah. <laughs>